Uh, welcome to Physics 231 Lab, uh, Magnetic Force on a Current Element. Uh, I just want to give you a feel for the setup so that when you uh, move on to the data portion that we provide, it's not a complete mystery. Um, and kind of give it a little bit more of a lab feel. Uh, so today what we have is a power supply, a current meter, this fun little apparatus that holds uh, these yellow wafers. Um, and they're going to be our current elements. And so they have these nice uh, centimeter, uh, two centimeter, et cetera, lengths on the bottom. And we're going to use those to send current through, and then we'll know the length of the element, as well as the current from the current meter. And we can do some calculations to try to calculate the B field of the uh, horseshoe magnet that we're using to feel the force. Um, so anyway, what we're going to do is send out current from our high current power supply, measure it on our um, multimeter because it is more precise than the current meter itself on the power supply, send it through this yellow wafer, and so we have our magnet on a kitchen scale um, and then teared so that it has a mass of zero. And so when we lower this with the current going, the scale will read uh, a, a mass now, and that mass will be the difference in force between just gravity and gravity and the force from the magnetic field on the current element. Um, and so using the, the mass information to gather a, a net force, we'll be able to um, make some calculations on the properties of the magnet that we have. Um, and so that's generally the gist of what we're doing. Again, we're going to send use our power supply as a current source, send current through our ammeter, send it through our circuit element, and then use the scale to measure the increase in force that the magnet feels when you send current through. Um, so now we're gonna provide you data for the two sections that you would normally do in class, um, but I hope this little introduction to the equipment kind of gives it a more tangible feel and helps you understand a little bit about, about what we're doing.